Hi, this is a quick demonstration of using a Paula Roland Hotbox and RNF waxes with a um, tool that I love using, and this is for a friend of mine on Instagram. And on the hot plate, I'm just um, adding some uh, black. I'm laying down a piece of Sumier paper to absorb the wax. Just taking a paper towel to help the uh, paper absorb the wax. And I want this to be pretty saturated. Right now it came up with some wonderful texture, but I'm just going to rub it into this wax to utilize all this wax because I want a good, nice surface. And I'm going to use a little bit of blue ochre, one of my favorite RNF colors. It is mixing in with the black, so it's a little darker than usual. I'm just going to wipe that in there. And again, I'm just uh, trying to saturate this paper so I have a good, nice, dark surface. Ah, nice. And so I'm going to just scrape this wax off real briefly so I have a nice, clean surface to work on. Off. I'm going to lay my paper uh, wax side up and now what I'm going to use are a variety of um, Stabilo woody pencils and I just love the creaminess of them and so I'm just going to draw right into that waxy print and I adore the creaminess of this product. Oh, it's just absolutely yummy. And if I go slower, it becomes even creamier and deeper in color. There are many choices to work from. I do need to sharpen this one real quickly. They, um, Stabilo comes with a special sharpener for these big fat pencils. They're very waxy and creamy. And just one more. I also like using an old-fashioned white china marker. It's the kind that you pull the string and then unravel the white, uh, the um, paper surrounding it. And it also has a, just a wonderful uh, creamy texture to it. Um, this is a little bit finer tip. And they come in white, black, blue, red, and yellow. The Stabilo Woodies come in a whole variety of colors. Um, and I love the silver and gold as well. And that's it. Thank you.